Tuckheads, I am back with another food review. Well, a review kind of, but it's probably something that won't be scored, if that makes any sense. Just because it's something we all, well, already like and probably would get a perfect 10 anyway. And here's the package. Limited edition, the most stuff Oreos. Most cream ever. Looks like there's a good supply of cream in these things. We all love Oreos. We all think they're the best ever. But we want to see if these really live up to the hype of the most stuff ever. And the pull-apart security... Uh, packaging now that keeps the moisture out of the cookies, especially those people that live down south that I know that watch this stuff probably really appreciate it because you keep that humidity out up here in the north woods where it's below zero today. Um, it really doesn't matter. This is It's not a bad winter up here, seriously, um, but it's already getting old. All right, here they are. You know, this is pretty... You know, sizable. It's a normal Oreo shell, but the cream in the middle. Quite a bit. Let's do the uh, twist. Yep. The one end does come off quite easily. That's an Oreo. The cream filling is basically... Two regular patties, or maybe a regular and a double stuff back to back. You can kind of tell they're almost put together. Mm. <laughs> when you were little, did you ever take apart your Oreos and take the cream off of each one? And make like a giant, huge Oreo cookie. I used to call it a Big Mac Oreo. I'd put like three or four of them, and then another Oreo, and then three or four of them, and then another Oreo on top, and then try to eat it. That explains my physique now. You're obviously, you're, you're obviously going to get less cookies because, I mean, let me check this out. I mean, they're pretty thick cookies, tanky cookies. So you get, let's see, uh, one, two, three, four, five, six in a roll. So you only get 18 cookies, but only 18 cookies and so much cream filling. I mean, enough for like 36 cookies. So you're getting... A bunch of the cream filling. Um, limited edition. Uh, probably for a good reason. Because if you continuously ate these particular Oreos, you'd probably turn into one. Um, but fantastic. I mean, this is something where I'd like to take like four or five of these. And take some vanilla ice cream and just put them all over the vanilla ice cream. Or just crunch them up or whatever it might be. That would be really good with these. Like I said, no score, but I just wanted to show people these because I know some folks were asking if I've tried these yet. So now, for the first time, I have, and you have all seen me do it. So that's my little dessert uh, video that I have for this early part of the week. We'll have something else coming up. Maybe another fast food review coming up. I want suggestions, folks. Let me know what you want to see from me and we'll try to get her done. Usually I can, you know, get a pretty good turnaround. If you if I know where it is or what it is, I can usually get my hands on it pretty quick. So, let me know in the comments below what you want to see. Have you tried these Oreos yet? Do you like them? Let me know in the comments below. Flip a like on the video if you can, if you liked it. If you didn't like it, put a thumbs down. That's okay too. But uh, I will uh, be back with another video soon. Stay tuned, folks, for another one from Tuck Daddy Productions.